here we go, five African greys. Uh, we do know one's called Roxy and the one's called Spook. And I must check for the exact dates on them. There's only this little fella I haven't got a deposit on, all the rest have. I will be DNA them, I'll DNA all the birds so we know all the sexes uh, that go to the new home. That's without any extra cost, that will be included in the tag. I certainly think this little fella here is a cockbird. I'm showing all the signs of being a cockbird. In the background you can hear the blue-throated macaw, uh, he's actually due to go shortly, he's got a deposit on and he's going to Minimoos, the uh, farm over in Chesley Street, I think they're going to display him there and hopefully free fly him. Mini moves is a, a little mini mini farm. Uh, it has rides, it has uh, children's displays, and it has uh, various farm farmhouse activities there to be seen. I think a lot of schools tend to go there, and they take the children on the day out. They're just branching out further and getting some uh, some parrots. They've just they've just bought uh, a pair of blue-fronted Amazons from me, and they're going to display them. And the blue throat macaw is going to be ready to go in the next week or so, and it'll be on display there. The African greys now, as you can see, coming along lovely. The feathering's coming on. This is obviously the oldest one of them all. And you can also see that the little red tail's coming. That's just starting to come through now. I can't do DNA them yet. I'll be taking some feathers off the chest. Uh, and we'll send them off for analysis to find out how many cocks and how many hens we've got. So at the moment we've got uh, two people, one hen birds. And I suspect there's two hens among the, amongst the five and the other customer's not particularly bothered, but we will find out the sex of them all. These are still getting fed every four hours. Weigh them on the morning so I know how much to give them up for each meal. They may look all the same to you, but believe me, once you've been feeding them every four hours, you do, you do get, to get to know each individual bird and they all have little personalities of their own. You wear them every morning because 
I don't feed them through the night, so there's no food in them by the time I feed them on the morning. And that'll give you the true weight of the bird. Uh, they should put on, like I say, I think I've mentioned it before, between 10 and 20 grams each day. Depending on the thickness of the solution that I give them, the hand rate of food.